Hi everyone, we're here to talk about the new Golf Pride Super Tech Grip that we've got on promotion at the moment. So I've just got a bit of a demonstration to show you how important it is to have a good grip on your club when you're playing golf. So what I've got here is I've got a um, 7 iron and it's got an old dirty grip here so I'm not going to have a very good grip on this club here. So what I'm going to do is have a swing with the launch miner and see what performance I get out of it. We'll analyze those numbers on the launch monitor a bit later. But we've got something a bit different now. Leading into winter time, if you have a look down here, this is a very important thing that will happen to you when you're playing golf. My grip is absolutely dripping wet there, as you can see. It was dirty, it was old, and now it's dripping wet. So let's see what performance I get out of swing number two. Don't stand over there, whatever you do. Okay, so now we're going to show you the difference between an old dirty grip and a wet one and a brand new Golf Ride Super Tech. Okay, now with the beauty of club fitting, we've got the exact same club head and we've changed the shafts with a different grip over. So, same shaft, but instead of the old dirty wet grip, we now have the Golf Ride Super Tech grip on. So it's exactly the same club, so we should see the same performance as far as the head of the club and the shaft goes. So, it's a really good tacky grip so you get a nice feel, you don't have to grip too tight, you can have relaxed hands and get a lot of efficiency as you swing. So let's see what I can get out of this one. Okay, once again, the super tack grip, the beauty of this one. Absolutely dripping wet, but when it's actually wet, the texture in the rubber keeps it nice and grippy so you don't lose the performance as you will on your old club. So once again, let's see what I can get out of this one. Okay, so we'll do now. We'll go and analyse the results from those swings there and we'll see whether I lost any performance with a really wet grip but a brand new super tank grip. So let's go and have a look. Okay, so as you see, the first shot with the old grip, there was 81 miles an hour club head speed, 154 distance, and a smash factor of 1.38. So once that grip was really wet, I swung faster, but much more inefficient. So I actually lost distance. So having to grip tighter on the wet grip meant that I lost a lot of efficiency and the ball didn't go nearly as far. We go down to the Golf Pride Super Tack grip, and already 89 miles of clubhead speed, 165 meters distance. So I've already hit the ball a lot further with a brand new grip. And when I dunked it in water and it was absolutely saturated, my speed didn't go down by much, but the efficiency was much the same. So I've only lost one meter of distance as opposed to losing five meters of distance. But you can see the overall distance with the brand new grip was far more efficient. And the great thing about the Super Tac, especially leading into winter, is when it was wet, I didn't lose any efficiency at all, and the difference between good and bad was almost nothing. So there's the benefits of brand new grips, there's the benefits of grips that can handle the wet weather. So come on in while we've got this promotion going and get your, get your clubs fitted with some new grips and um, get more consistency straight away.